Okay. Hello. Hello. My name is Penny. I'm from Canada, St. Catharines, Ontario, in Canada. I started my Camino uh, Healthy in uh, St. Jean Pied de Port on the 10th of September 2013. I walked as far as Navarretta when I was hurt. Um, they said in the hospital that I had tendonitis, but I believe it's bursitis. And my uh, knee and my leg and my foot became inflamed. And anyway, um, after visiting the hospital twice and uh, talking to physiotherapists and, and various doctors, I bought a pair of crutches in Burgos. And I, there are, yeah, there are two here. <laughs> and I um, went from city to city on a bus and recovered uh, enough so that I could walk from Saria on crutches. That's so a hundred, that's a hundred uh, kilometers. 115 Till kilometers. Santiago. Yes, yes. Until Santiago. So I, I believe we're in the last 20 kilometers right now. And I'm doing the entire um, 115 kilometers remaining on crutches. Um, I wanted to say that when I was in Burgos, I spoke to a hospitalero who um, had been a football player and also had done uh, some time with the Spanish army and suffered from tendonitis. He told me that, the, um, uh, that I have one pair of knees, I should protect them, and that the Camino has been here for over a thousand years and will be here for me to come back well and walk the Camino. So. Yes. Um, that's, that's a nice story. Yes. That's yes. the story. Yes. yes, okay, nice. And uh, uh, what, what the Camino gives you? What is the experience for you? The, the experience before my injury is very different from my experience after the injury. So I think what I want to say is that um, um, these last 115 kilometers as well as the time that I spent in um, albergues and hostels when I was, when I was um, injured has shown me that people are extraordinarily kind. I'm going to cry. Yes. <laughs> they were so helpful and all along the path people, including yourself, people have stopped and asked, you know, if I am okay, can they give me anything, water, painkillers, you yes. know, uh, ibuprofen. Um, advice, uh, they've shared their stories and I, I think it's because we have the Camino in common and we all have injuries, we all have blisters, we're walking with, we're walking with pain, we're walking with joy and yeah. people have been so wonderful to me in these, especially in these last 115 yeah. kilometers. We have all our nose in the same direction. Yes we do, that's a good way of, of saying it. Yes. yes absolutely. <laughs> okay. Yes. Now, uh, you told me your uh, your uh, grandmother was a Dutch. Yes, my grandmother so, came yeah. from Holland. Yes. Yeah. And now after this, you go. Uh, We're for going a few, to Amsterdam. To Amsterdam to now. stay with my husband's family. Okay. For, yes. Okay. Uh, now uh, I wish you an, uh, uh, a lot of health. Thank you. And a good stay in Holland. Thank, Thank you. Thank you, very you for much. this interview. Buen camino.